Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the React Native. Today we are going to learn about the React Native Segmented Control tab. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. Segmented Control tab in React Native. So here we have the package that is this one. NPMI React Native Segmented Control. The number of downloads it has 18,000. Okay, so it's pretty much good, <coughs> right? So let's see how we are going to do that. So first you have to install this one, npm install. Okay, then we have to import segmented control tab from the React Native se segmented control tab. Okay, so currently it's a class based component, right? I have done with the functional based components. Let's have a look on that one. So here we go with that one. <coughs> okay, oh, sorry, I forgot to show you the demo first. So this is that one, two, three with the batches. Then segmenting control with the multiple selections. Okay, so you do with the multiple selections. Then it's a single selection, right? And this custom segmenting control with the custom styles. Okay, so this is basically the custom one. Okay, so let's see how we have going to build that one. So let's start it with the step by step. So here we go with that one. Okay, so this is the full fledged code of that one. So see very carefully on that one. So this is the default that we are always using the use state from the React style sheet text view from the React Native and the segmented control tab from the React Native segmented control tab. By default, the states are zero. Okay, so whenever we have the handle single index text, then make it set selected index, which index we have selected. If there are multiple, then let's go with the multiple slices we are going to going to add and then at the last we are going to do set select indices to be that indices okay for the multiple if we are go with the custom then set the custom style index to be that index okay so here we have the segmented control so this is first control where we have a selected index right tab style okay then active tab style with, with the that style sheet on on tab press handle single index okay the next view we have the multiple so you need to pass the multiple selected indices is this one and handle the multiple index okay this is that function okay so index and then we are going to filter out with that index and then set that indexes over here okay the next one that we have the segment in control with the batches if i go over here you can see that we have the batches one two or three right so here we have the batches one two three selected index and then on tab press handle single index select okay the last we have the custom then we have the values one or two selected index okay on tab press custom border radius tab container style we have given tab style we have given okay then we have active tab style we have background on the margin tab text over here then active tabs text style also there okay and if the custom style index equal equal to zero if it is zero then this is the text tab one if it is one then tab two index content tab content is here okay here you can see that right tab one or tab two okay in the here you can see whenever we have the two or the one okay next this is done next we have the style sheet very important so we have the container then we have a header text so all of the style sheet over here we have added separators tab style and active tab style and then export that segmented view so this is the full fledged code okay so any doubt any query do let me know in the comment section in the same way here you can also see right the segmented control value first second third selected index on tab press and this will go with the state okay the same logic we have also implemented okay so any doubt any query in that there here we have them you can say that the props so you can enable boolean to enable or disable the component multiple is there border radius is there right so you can use the rest of the props like this okay tab style last tab text style active tab style style you want to give so anything you can add you can go over here okay the documentation part Okay, so any doubt, any query, do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.